Yeah. And the Woolsey fire has brought shock and sadness to Southern California's Jewish community. Now, two legendary Jewish summer camps located up in the Malibu Hills have been destroyed. Tonight, NBC4 investigative reporter Joel Grover joins us with a look at the impact of this loss for the very first time. Over 40,000 children have spent their summers at Camp Hess Kramer and its sister camp called Gindling Hilltop. And the LAUSD uses the Malibu camp every week for science school. It took only hours for the Woolsey fire to ruin 87 out of 97 of the camp's buildings. Flames are still smoldering in the charred remains of two beloved summer camps. A paradise overlooked the Pacific now reduced to ashes. Massive destruction. Corey Winter is head of safety and security for Camp Hess Kramer and its sister camp, Gindling Hilltop, a place where children have gone to camp since the 1950s. Happy children having the time of their life. No uh, worries in the world. Some 200 children were getting ready for sleep in these cabins Thursday night when they were suddenly evacuated. Within hours, flames leveled all but one cabin. Flames so fierce, they melted the cabin's metal doors and twisted the heating ducts. The fire also leveled this activity hall, this dance hall, and this sanctuary. This is the outdoor chapel. Yep. Where Camp Hess Kramer held daily prayer services. The ark where sacred Torah scrolls were kept burned down. But the camp managed to save three holy scrolls. 13-year-old Ava Maxwell has spent her summers at Camp Hess Kramer. Those were some places where I made some of the best memories of my life. But at the same time, after this, I can go home where other families don't have a home anymore. And just up the mountain, Camp Hilltop with a stellar view of the Pacific. And everything over here is wood. There, only two cinder block buildings survived, ten cabins burned down as well as this dining hall, a building rebuilt just 11 years ago after another fire. Two beloved camps burned to the ground, but families say the camps will live on. The, the thing that made, or that makes Hess Kramer and Hilltop so special is still there. It's the people, it's the organization, it's the community. Both camps are owned by Wilshire Boulevard Temple, one of L.A.'s largest synagogues. A spokesman tells me the camps were insured and they do plan to rebuild. Angel.